Choke Manifold In today's video, I will be presenting one of the major equipment that controls the flow rate and the pressure at the wellhead. It is called the Choke Manifold and it is located downstream of the flowhead. The choke manifold is used to control the fluid from the well by reducing the flowing pressure and by achieving a constant flow rate before the fluid enters the processing equipment on the surface. When testing a well, the aim is to impose critical flow across the choke. When critical flow is achieved, changes pressure and flow rate made downstream from the choke do not affect downhole pressure and flow rate. The choke manifold consists of Four gate valves used to isolate the choke boxes on either side of the choke manifold. A fixed choke box to insert calibrated choke beans of different diameters, depending on the pressure and flow rate required. An adjustable choke to gain quick control of the well and to change fixed choke beans without interrupting the flow. Tapping points for measurement of the upstream and downstream pressures. A thermometer well inserted in the flow path allowing the fluid temperature to be monitored. The choke manifold, with a design featuring a fixed and adjustable choke, is a versatile piece of equipment. At both chokes, the size of the orifice that fluid flows through can be varied, allowing maximum control over fluid flow rate and pressure. In addition, the adjustable choke makes it possible to control flow pressure without stopping the well, further enhancing the flexibility of the system. The combination of a fixed and adjustable choke allows the choke manifold to achieve various flow rates, low and high, as needed to support well testing requirements and client specifications. The principal functions of the choke manifold includes Safety function by controlling the well head pressure. It allows different choke sizes to control the flow rate. It prevents water and gas coning by limiting the flow rate. It prevents formation sand from entering the well by limiting the flow rate. It ensures critical flow where the pressure fluctuations downstream of the choke manifold do not affect downhole pressure and flow rate of the well. The choke manifold is part of the minimum set of surface testing equipment needed when a well is being tested. It is used whenever the fluid flow rate and pressure need to be controlled altered for the purpose of testing the well. Common operation, changing from adjustable choke to fixed choke. Step 1, Preparation of Fixed Choke Box Adjust the adjustable choke until the flow stabilizes. Then prepare the equivalent fixed choke to be installed. Step 2, Pressurizing Fixed Choke Box Open the downstream valve of the fixed side to equalize pressure. It is advisable to open the downstream rather than the upstream for safety measure. Step 3. Diverting the flow from adjustable to fixed side. Open simultaneously upstream valve on the fixed side whilst upstream valve on the adjustable side is closed. Step 4. Flow through fixed choke. The downstream valve on the adjustable side is closed and pressure bled off on the adjustable choke. Different types of choke manifolds are available according to its working pressure and the type of gate valves. Choke manifolds are available in 5000, 10000, and 15000 psi. The wide range of choke manifolds available makes it possible to select a choke manifold that accommodates the well tests required while not being larger, more complicated, or expensive than the overall project requires. The choke manifolds have four gate valves arranged in such a way that the flow can be directed through either the fixed or the adjustable choke. The valves are opened and closed by hand wheels. The types of valves available on different choke manifolds include McAvoy, Marlbrank, Sarek, and WOM.
please hit like and subscribe to our YouTube channel to help us produce more content like this one. Thank you for your attention.